All right, welcome back. So I have this donor ship here that I have built. Uh, it's not a particularly good ship, uh, but it's the point that counts for the ship. So we are going to test out the new, newly added two creations, uh, place doors and ladders yourself. I have been having some problems with this. I hope this is a me issue and not a, the mod issue. And we're going to test that out today. I'm going to show you the path of what I want for doors. And I'm going to show you how bad the Starfield game itself does. So we come in through side docker. Cockpit here. Cockpit only has two crew stations. So I also have a battle stations. Everything is right here. So if I want to dock, I come out of the cockpit. Bam, dock. Or just uh, come out here to the landing bay. Here's what I want. I want a door here to my captain's quarters. I want a door here to the engineering bay, and I want a door here to the armory. I don't want any doors here, and I don't want a door here. I want no ladders of any kind. This top floor is going to be for crew. So I have a large mess hall. This mess hall also has kind of living quarters-ish like kind of things. I want a door here that comes into this 3 by one I want no doors along this path. I want no doors along this path. I want an individual door to each of these one by ones because I'm going to turn each one into a uh, crew cabin. So six separate crew cabins. I realize I have more uh, crew than that, but six separate crew cabins plus my uh, own captain's quarters. And then this living quarters has its own. So let us take a look and see just how poorly the game codes it to place doors and ladders, even when you do your best effort to line them up in order so that you can get them the way you want. There is no door there. Captain's quarter has a ladder. That's That makes perfect sense. Let's see where the ladder goes to. Into a one by one all by itself. Yep, totally makes sense. So no ladders up there. We come back into the armory. It's got a ladder. Now we'll come back to that. A second ladder and a door. So we finally get to the engine bay, which engineering bay, which I wanted the door there. All right, no other perforations. Let's start with this room here. So we come up to a one by one. We're able to get into the mess hall. There should be a door right here if it was to do it the way I wanted it to, but it did not. So we come in here and just a one by one by itself. And now we get into the three by one demos. And a door to a single one by one. So one of them worked. And a door into another. All right, so two of the one by ones worked. And four of them didn't. I mean, technically, you could say this worked, although it popped a uh, ladder in it. And I'm going to guess this is two one by ones attached to each other. It is. So, vanilla game, doing your best effort to get these things uh, set up the way you want, and you can see the mess that it is. I'm going to go uh, log off. I'm going to enable this set system. I'm going to set the doors where I want them, and then we'll do another tour. All right, moment of truth. Let's find out if the placed doors actually work the way I wanted them to. So, cockpit. We have a passway. I did open this myself because uh, I hate OBS so much. It's uh, such a shitty program. But here we are. All right, so there are no ladders, no other perforations. I chose passway. That is a no door option. So no door into the uh, engineering bay. Probably you would have a door, but I chose I didn't want to have a door, so no door. But I did choose to have a door on the armory, which does indeed work fine. Excellent. No ladders. Perfect. Let's come into the armory. No other connections. No ladders. Exactly the way we want it. Outstanding. So now we have to go up the actual stairs because we do not have ladders now. Perfect. 
So we wanted... Alright, no, we wanted a straight pass to there. A brief history of time. And it's exactly what it gave us. I chose another pathway. This is the 3 by one And then we have individual one by ones that will act as bedrooms once I get them set up. Perfect. No other additional perforations. Perfect. So far, it sure seems like this mod uh, works outstanding, exactly as advertised. All right. Last pair. Outstanding. So, we have the six pod bedrooms, if you will, facing a three by one uh, on your mind? living room, essentially. And then we have additional living space in this mess hall, which works out perfectly. It's got a kitchen and all that. You have the two deck cockpit. You've got this to add your crew quarters. You've got your captain's quarters that is unfortunately missing the head. It is what it is. And then you have your engineering bay. So let's go take a look at how this works. This is not going to be a full detailed tutorial on how to use the the uh, mod, but I just want to give you a brief as to what I did to make it work. So we come in here to the ship, and first thing you're going to notice when I pull this off, there's a pink part right there. So what this mod does it disables every entry point with exception to the cockpit, the docker, and the landing bay. Those three just stay exactly as they are, but everything else is set to disable. Every porthole, every window, every ladder, every door. Nothing functions until you tell it to function. You can see I put door starboard. So if I click G here and I come over here to Habs, you now have two additional options before. Shutter, I think, is Windows. I haven't gone too deep into this yet, but you got your doors. And also, uh, port and starboard didn't seem to matter. Neither did fore and aft. I have not used this option yet, so I will get there. But that allowed me to place just a singular door right here. Coming back... Let me zoom out. There we go. If I pull this back, you can see I put passway and passway allowed me to put a no door solution then on this one because it is an armory I chose to have a door solution moving up top what I did is I took these three on both sides and I just pulled them out and on the three by one I stuck a door on each one so that since they are crew cabins I wanted them to have their own privacy now, and I did this on both sides. For the three by one, I stuck in another passway. So no door option here, doors to these. So they get their privacy, but movement along this is, is faster and easier. I will probably, once I kind of, I would say master this mod out, I'll do a more tutorial level version of video, but I just wanted to showcase to this showcase this to you so that you could see if it's something you want to have. I uh, just came out on Creations Club. It is the same uh, mod author that has been out for quite some time on uh, Nexus. I have been told that it does work on Xbox. I don't have an Xbox, so I can't say for sure. Uh, I'll link down in the description and in the comments uh, how to get this if you want it, but it is in the Creation Club. Uh, thanks for watching.